Hey, hey, I'm Thomas, and today I want to show you how to make these really simple mahogany coasters that also look really classy. Uh, it only takes a few tools to make them, and it should only take an afternoon or a day at the most. And I think they're really fun to make, so let's get to it. For this project, I start by making sure my table saw blade is at 90 degrees and cutting off any unwanted edges. Since I don't have a bandsaw, I'm going to be ripping this board with my table saw to about 3 8 of an inch thick. Just make sure you do this safely and your fingers are far away from the blade. You can use the table saw for this next step, but I find that the miter saw makes quick work of cutting these coasters to their final dimensions. I use a stop block to make sure that the cuts are repeatable and these coasters end up being right about three and three quarter inches by three and three quarter inches. I sanded them with 80, 120, 150, then 220 grit sandpaper. And you can sand them before you cut them. I just decided to cut them first and then sand each one. It doesn't really make a difference. I used a 45 degree chamfer bit for the profile on these. And the bottom of these coasters, I went a little deeper with the chamfer. I think it just looks really nice. I always like to pop the grain with some water and then I lightly hand sand each one with 220 grit sandpaper. It makes them really smooth before I put the finish on them. To finish these up, I use three coats of wipe on poly and this gives it a nice film finish and ensures that no liquid will penetrate the coasters and it still protects whatever is underneath the coasters from any sort of liquid damage. I've also used spray lacquer which works really well also. The very last thing that I like to do, which I think takes these coasters to the next level, is putting these little felt feet on them. This just makes sure that they're really quiet when they touch the table and they don't scratch your table, and I think they look really nice. And that's it. A super simple project, but also a really practical project. Until next time.